Today is the eighth story from the Gateless Gate from the book Zen Flesh Zen Bones written by K. Paul Rips. Keicho's wheel. Alone his destruction gets you and said to his student, Keicho, the first wheel maker of China, made two wheels of 50 spokes each. Now suppose you remove the nail uniting the spokes. Everybody together does the Kapalapadi. That's the Kriya by drinking five glasses of water, putting the finger in the mouth and then cleansing it up every Sunday. And, and one day I told my student, today I'm going to teach you this one. And I said, okay, five glasses of water with a little bit of, little bit of, little bit of warm water with a little bit of salt on it. Drink five glasses, put two fingers and then vomit it up, cleanses it up. That I'm going to teach you on Sunday. And then we'll do it every Sunday. Then one man from Himachal Pradesh, he was the strongest man of India, Chambalka Raja KK Chant. When I taught this one, he started laughing. I said, why did you laugh? Why are you making joke of me? He said, no Guruji, <laughs> I thought you were going to teach me something great, a break, very big yoga technique. No, this one when I saw, I was shocked. I said, what? In our house, early morning, one bindi game means one big oh, vessel which may be having a one or two liters or more than that. You just take the Bendike water, just take it. They fully the drink and they don't even have to put the fingers. Every <laughs> That was the Samskriti. Together, when children fall sick, the mother, might, when I taught them, they look, when, we, when you fall sick, we will take the um, Ramdev Maharaj's um, cow urine. So we bought the cow urine, distilled cow urine and I said one cap, it is stinking so much of smell. So one cap, mix it up with six cap of warm water and you drink morning one and evening one and, and we did that and of course there was a great benefit but some of the village girls were laughing. I said what? What Guruji, one cap, six cap of warm water mix it up in our village. When we were small, when we fall sick, my, my mommy will take them right under the cow. That is a nutty cow, daisy cow. And we directly drink, take bath also. Now with the with mom, we do not have to tell you. Suppose we have a stomach pain or we have a headache, we feel there is going to be fever. We ourselves go, there is nobody to teach us. The Samskriti is not broken. And then you stop that telling, that was wrong. You stop them from taking the rock salt. When, when disease is spread, you take a handful of rock salt and spread it out. When you come from outside, that was the culture. When you come from outside, you remove slippers outside the house. Now, houses are created according to the Western standard to put the slippers inside because they were frightened robbers. They created the robbers. There. Those days, there were no robbers. Nobody touches another slippers. They leave the slippers outside. Take bath outside. And then only entered the house. Now outside was never there. They created the bathroom right inside the house. They brought in diseases right inside the house. They broke them into pieces. The Sanskrit is different. Nobody does yoga together, pranayama together, meditation together. Without pranayama, without asanas, without dhyana. Nobody goes outside the house. They are together. They work together. Practices together. Eat together the same plate, they decide what food and so that wherever they go, they are conscious that I have to bring that plant, I have to produce this more. I know electrical, plumbing, sanitary, masonry, carpentry, painting, everybody knows and everybody together decides. In our school, people bring huge amount of materials and the, the moment they stop the vehicle, they say, can you bring some men over there? I just give a small bell and all my kids will come running. They said, these small girls, small boys. <laughs> and they are 6 standard, 7 standard, 8 standard, 10 standard. Within 5 minutes, everybody catches and the whole truck is empty. We become doing together. We completed it. And together was strength. Gateswan said to his students, Gateswan, the first wheel maker of China, made two wheels of 50 spokes each. Your parents created the Samskriti. 50 spokes each created the line. 50 spokes each too. They created the yin and the yang, the power. Now suppose you remove the navel uniting the spokes. 
you removed it asking that we will sell the property will stay in america or wherever which are countries and send my parents into the old age home you removed the spokes what happened your wheel is not going forward you must have had the money in the bank fixed deposit for somebody else to take that money and double it up and make you a nobody within seconds you'll come to know within seconds it starts stinking now suppose you remove the nave uniting this what would become of the wheel the wheel which is going forward together you had to push there was a story a bullock cart was carrying materials and before the sun set he should cross this forest to reach the other side if he doesn't cross this then wild animals attack and kill him exactly just before the sun set half an hour before the sunset suddenly the vehicle refused to move the bullocks refused to move and he got down from the bullock cart he started crying to all the gods krishna allah jesus christ buddha mahavira i have been praying to you all please please help me and suddenly it seems an old man appeared and said what son what's your problem he said the wheels are not moving he said never mind I'll put one shoulder on this wheel and you put your shoulder on other wheel and together you scream Krishna Allah Buddha Mahavira Jesus whatever you name you wanted whichever you loved it put it into your shoulder and scream so this man put the sh- shoulder into one of the wheel and the old man put it on another wheel and they scream Krishna and they push it the bullock moved faster he could cross the forest he turned around and looked he couldn't find the old man he thought that can be a god which came in god's form you can make sure that you alone cannot push the wheel you have to have your wife you have to have the joint family you have to have a family tree together was strength what could become of the wheel and had can't you done this had your grandfather removed the spokes Could he be called the master wheel maker? He couldn't be called the head of the family. He couldn't be called the family tree. Think over it. What has happened has happened. Now please go back. You still there is time to connect the family, the joint family. And the moment you have the family and the joint family, family tree, you are the most powerful, lovable people in the world. There is no diseases, and only lot of happiness and money.